Uh, you know, every club in Ireland has been decimated at the moment because they're losing players, you know, and because of jobs. If somebody in that club think outside of the box, I suppose, is, is the word we have to use, they think outside of the box and they see an opportunity for they know of somebody or they know of some company or whatever that could set up somewhere in Ireland. Maybe those, maybe they could even reward those same players by giving them jobs. The, the great thing about this is the win-win-win for everybody. You know, if you can get a job, or even one job into Ireland, it's a win-win situation. If you're lucky enough to get 100 or whatever, you create one job, it makes more jobs. And I think this is what people must realise. It's, it might only be the, a phone call or an email or a word of mouth over a point. But do not be afraid to do it because it could be the difference of, of creating jobs, keeping money in your club or whatever. As I've been very lucky with travel in particular, with my involvement in rugby and no business and uh, travel all over the world and it's, um, you know, I haven't watched that video and it's just to see how simple it is to get somebody to, to set up in Ireland and it's, it's a fantastic idea because at the end of the day, and I think the message of it that was given out there is we all need to pull together, we all need to help each other out and uh, this is a fantastic initiative. Why not set up in Ireland? You know, we've seen that some of the top companies in the world, particularly pharmaceutical companies, top 10 companies in the world are based in Ireland. And I think a lot of people don't know that, and particularly companies abroad wouldn't know that. So I think the message has to get out there. Ireland is the place to start up.